EVE Online is one of the biggest multiplayer role-playing games out there with 300,000 monthly players. Set in space, you can be anyone, a fighter, a trader, or even a pirate. Whilst exploring the universe, players can also engage in a mini-game called Project Discovery, where they analyse cell clusters. Now, although it's just part of the game for them, they're actually sifting through real-world data for researchers who are examining how the coronavirus affects blood cells. It's a gamified version of a scientific technique called flow cytometry, which is used to measure physical characteristics of a population of cells or particles. So far, over 171,000 players have completed 47 million tasks, which amounts to 36 years of categorizing cells. Like, it's, you just, you look at a plot and you just draw polygons around data. You can just sit there, pull it up and start doing it. And I think that was exciting to me, just how approachable it was. You know, you hear about the COVID research or COVID going on all around the world. A lot of people like you know have had it or know someone who's had it. And just the fact that I can sit here at my desk while I'm waiting for a fleet, doing something that's going to contribute to, you know, helping find out information about COVID-19. The data generated by the players accelerates the scientists' ability to determine what's in the blood of COVID-19 patients. That information provides an insight into how our bodies react to the virus and how therapies that are being developed interact with both the coronavirus and our immune systems. And as players have been so successful at the data classification, they've been given even more complex tasks by the team behind the project. It's really just like citizen science to a T. We had a, a giant group of people and we made this fun. We, we gamified this quite a bit. There's incentives for people to do it that'll uh, boost their game experience, but it's also just the, the, the heart and soul of our community as well. These are things that our people really enjoy and this really is for the greater good. And that was the strength of this project in particular where this came out when everybody in the world was at its height of being affected of this. Okay, what we're gonna do, guys, is we're gonna sit 10k off a target, we're gonna blap it really quick, and then we're gonna warp to the run spot. Does that make sense? Roger. Yep, yep. Outstanding. Okay, stand by. And it's not just about the bonuses for the players. EVE Online's community is keen to support the scientific effort in the fight against COVID-19. That's just phenomenal that I have this opportunity just playing a video game. And I think that's really kind of what got me into it is that I can sit at my desk in the comfort of my home and I can help researchers do something, you know, make a difference. And that's kind of cool. Triage carriers are going to jump, just the triage carriers are first. Everyone clear? <laughs>